Obesity and metabolic syndrome go hand in hand. How many of you know what metabolic syndrome is? Okay, have you ever, has anyone heard of it? Does it sound like something you've heard about? Okay, by the end of it today, I want every single one of you to know what metabolic syndrome is. You need to know this, because it affects 30 to 40% of us. Okay, we're, and you're gonna know that by the end of today. And many of our children, especially overweight children, are affected by metabolic syndrome. It affects our metabolism, it affects our risk for heart disease and for diabetes, and it's absolutely treatable. So that's, again, powerful stuff. If you look at what's happening, uh, in the world, in the United States, this is our picture of the United States, you can see the prevalence of obesity. Um, if you look back to the earlier slides, 1990, 1998 to 2006, new colors need to be created for the percentage of the population that's overweight. Clearly, um, this is affecting our world, it's affecting all of us. And are we at fault? I don't know. Should we, should we exercise more? Absolutely. Should we be eating differently? Absolutely. But there's a lot of things that contribute to this. And some of it's our fault, and some of it's maybe not. Some of it is genetic things that we can potentially